Young lady, can you please tell us your name? Um, my name is Jasmine Rocha. Jasmine, how old are you, my friend? I'm 14. Fabulous. Young man, you are? Paul Roscoe. Paul, how old are you? 15. 15. And this young man right here? And you're a high school student young as well, man. is this true? I'm a high school student. And your name is? No, my name is Nettie Gabriel Limas. And, and I'm uh, the lead artist in this project. This is uh, Yosemite National Park. Mm -hmm. And so what we were trying to do is, um, you know, stick stick within the idea of, of John Muir um, something that will appeal to the school mm -hmm. and to the principal. Did you know who John Muir was, honestly, before you started this project? Um, you be honest, it's okay, you can tell me. I, no. No, okay. <laughs> That's cool. Yeah, no, That's cool. Not, uh, oh, that's cool. So you guys actually learned something about your school and, and California history. So what, what, what was uh, one, one interesting fact you learned about John Muir that you didn't know? Um, one interesting fact. John Muir was an activist mm -hmm. and he basically open everybody's eyes, like open the public's eyes to what you're doing is wrong and we should preserve this beautiful country that we live in. One of the things that, um, that we we're trying to do is kind of show them and it's in, in showing the process that it takes to, to do a mural. So here we had, we wrote a proposal, we, you know, we uh, gave it to the, to the principal and we had to wait to see if they approve it and if they, wow. you know, and if the space where it's supposed to be is okay or ask for permission for those things. So they got, they got to, to do that and wow. we wrote a, you know, a little proposal and then they, they each signed it, um, you know, just to get them used to the idea that, hey, you know, you're, you're being professional and you're, mm -hmm. um, you know, uh, advocating for yourself or Darn for the too. space that you're going to work in. We had a lot of the filling in mm -hmm. to create this image. But it was not. It's not just filling in. The, it's it's finding the, the right colors that would give you these values of, of you know where you go from dark to light, and and then some other students we had them do the blending. Uh, but in, interesting enough, you know, as, as when you look at some of these lines, you think like, well, they're just lines. But sometimes it could be one of the most hardest things to to get that straight line and. Um, and to really cut out those shapes, so uh, I think uh, it was it was a lot of work, and uh, the students did a really good job of uh, of uh, you know working as a team together. The hope is that you know the viewer would start to think about um, something when you have something so beautiful and things coming in and destroying it. So start thinking about the environment. So cool. that was the basic premise here, and you know to really. Uh, uplift or pay homage to who John Muir was.